I mean, I was just like, oh, let me just, let me just take some of this. And just, oh, it's raining peachy goodness. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm bringing you a video that is honestly quite overdue since we are in like June when I'm filming this. No idea when it's going up because my filming schedule is weird. My birthday was in May and I am now finally bringing you what I got for my birthday. Um, I got quite a few things. I got a lot more makeup and beauty related products this time around as well as some other things. So let's just get into it. If you want to see what I got for my 28th birthday. Starting off with something that I will have already done a review on. This is the Dream Glow Kit from my wonderful husband. You guys, I will not say how I feel about this palette. I will leave the video linked down below for you all. But you guys know I am a slave to the glow kits. We'll always buy them. So that was a wonderful thing from my dear loving partner and from my good friend Cameron he must have seen my most recent anti haul and he picked me up the wet n wild color icon baked blush from their flights of fancy collection you guys would have seen that anti haul I anti the whole collection but said I might get the blushes this one here is in dare to soar it's a really pretty just like deep pink this one is hummingbird hype which looks like a super jacked up shimmery version of their like um rose champagne color and then this one is don't flutter yourself which looks kind of like a once again jacked up super shimmery version of pearlescent pink so i am super excited to try these out you guys know i love a crazy illuminating blush Continuing on from my wonderful husband, he just did just kind of like an order whatever, and I was like, oh, okay. He got me some of them nice Fenty highlighters. He got me the one in Mean Money and Hustler Baby um, Trophy Wife, which I think he was thinking, I think I was talking about, and I was like, oh, I could do some nice avant-garde makeup with that. And so he was just like, okay. And then Lightning Dust and Fire Crystal. I absolutely love the packaging on these. I had mentioned to him that I wanted to try more of these. I have her Metal Moon one, which is just one of the singles. This is a trophy wife. I am looking forward to trying to do some avant-garde makeup looks, or I might try doing this like all over my eyes, then as a highlighter, and then like topping off a neutral lipstick with this. We will definitely have to see. It is definitely a dark skinned friendly highlighter but the extra in me really wanted to try that out then these are the freestyle highlighter duos this one is the mean money and hustler baby and the reason i was interested in these whoops thing fell out is when i went into sephora in tennessee i was kind of like not interested and then i like you have a more subtle side and then a more whatever side and i was swatching them and i like swatched the subtle side and i was like yeah okay that's pretty and i swatched the more extreme side yeah that's pretty and then I put the extreme one on top of the subtle one. I was like, that's really pretty. So I was very interested in trying out. Then this one is Lightning Dust and Fire. Oops. Plastic crystal going on there. I am so excited to wear these just all over my face and see what I think about them because there's a lot of things from Fenty I want to try, but new makeup's expensive. Then he also got me, I don't know, I think you're going to see these in a video, in like a makeup drawer video because they were in there. I've had this stuff for a while now. Two of the Kat Von D um, 24 hour super brow long wear pomade. He got me the shade Roxy Purple, which looks like this. I have used these. I'm probably not going to do a video dedicated to them. I am using the Lemmy Green shade on like my ombre eyebrows today. These are absolutely amazing. They are super pigmented, very creamy, and then they dry down to like a perfect matte. They're absolutely amazing. I love these 110 times more than my Anastasia brow pomade, so I need to just get more colors of these because they're just absolutely 
wonderful and they make me happy in so many different ways. And then sort of a random thing, he must have heard me talking about this or something, or maybe it was on my like loves list and I'd forgotten to take it off, is the Kristen Leanne and Urban Decay Highlighter Palette Trio thing. It's absolutely adorable. It comes in this like pink toned plastic packaging there. It looks like this. And it looks so pretty. I had heard, I anti-hauled this whole collection a couple anti-hauls back. And then I was like seeing people, they were like, it's so amazing, it's so amazing. Like if there was one thing they would be keeping out of the collection, it was this highlighter palette. And so I was like, mm, kind of curious. It went on sale for $17. And I think it was in my loves list or my husband heard me talking about it, but he picked this out, which makes me so happy. I cannot wait to have this all over my face. And then that order also came with, I don't know if he accidentally redeemed some of my points. Oh, no, no, no. This was, I think, my beauty, my, my um, birthday gift from Sephora. This is the Glam Glow Hello Sexy Super Mud Clearing Treatment and Glow Starter Mega Illuminating Moisturizer. Glam Glow is not cruelty free, so this is going to go in the giveaway section. Then from a, another friend of mine, Brandon, who is, he and I are friends on Instagram. He is an amazing makeup artist person. He and I have used each other's faces a lot of times for artistic inspiration. Come on, yeah, so I can do your makeup. And he actually picked me up something that I will treasure forever. The Wet n Wild Gothographic Loose Highlighter in... What is this? Moon Tears? I'm pretty sure it was Moon Tears. But out of that collection that I was unable to get my hands on basically anything, he got me this. People went crazy for this. They're like, oh, I don't like loose highlighters, but this one is amazing and the formula is yada, 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 yada. So I was just so happy and grateful that he thought of my cute little gothic makeup loving butt and bought me this. Then, on top of all that, he also got me the two singles. This one is in, oh my goodness, Purple Ashes. I have tucked into these. And then this one is White Raven. People were saying these were really good too. And like I said, I missed, was unable to get any of that. And then to top it all off, he also got me the single of Diamond Lily, which was a shade in their highlighter palette that was made permanent. So I'm just so grateful. Drugstore makeup that makes me so happy. And from my good friend Steven, as which has become tradition on my birthday, he purchased me, purchased, purchases me a pair of alternative shoes. I think you would have seen a pair that I got last year. And this year we got the black Why Are You plus Nikki Lipstick Baby platforms with the heart cut out. I now have the pink and the black pair, which make me so happy. I just, I look forward to this every year because he is just, he is just such a, such a sweetheart who knows me so well. And last but not least, this is strictly speaking, not what someone got for me straight up. My aunt Carly sent me some money for my birthday and my mom and I were out a couple days ago, which is kind of why I waited to do all this. And she was all like, we were just doing something. And I was like, oh, look, there's a Bath and Body Works. I haven't been to Bath and Body Works for years. Let's go in. And they were having their semi-annual sale. And we did some pretty good damage. So I will start off with the bits that my mother got me. And then what I used my birthday money for. The first thing, I have used some of these. The first thing is this mineral body polish plus hyaluronic acid. This is from their like water collection. This was not on sale, but I wanted something for my face. I went to the lady and I said, hey, do you have any kind of exfoliating scrub that's like safe to use on my face? And she said, yes, this and it's great for dry skin because it's got water. It smells amazing I could just bathe in this and I've used it on my face and it made my face feel smooth and bright and amazing and I just I felt fantastic 
fantastic using this and I look forward to using it more but my mom bought me that and she also got me two of these these were 50% off these are the aqua no this is from mineral and company I think they are illuminating fragrance mists this one here is in aqua marine and then this one is in moonstone I don't know I just thought I mean they were glittery and shiny I mean they get you with the packaging on so many of these things but it was just really pretty and I was like okay yeah mom I'd, I'd, I'd like those and then full priced items that I got was the oh my goodness they get you with how it smells you go in there and you're like hmm oh I can't live with it. I mean that is how they get you and this we were we had smelled it because my mother and I love peach we just love peach and we like opened it up I was like mom smell that I mean you can smell the fuzz on this peach in here and so we tried it we put it on it was it was so smooth and it smelled amazing so this is the pretty as a peach ultra shea body cream 24 hour moisturizer and then because I love peach and I love their fine fragrance mist I also got the pretty as a peach I mean just look at the packaging it's so gorgeous so I got this and then just for like kicks and giggles I also wanted the pretty as a peach diamond shimmer mist once again it's fully glitter not sure what I'm gonna do with it cuz I don't go to the beach that often but it just it smelled yummy it had glitter in it and it was just super pretty and it was buy three get two free so mom was able to get she got this that better not be leaking she got this and also the pretty as a peach just the regular hand lotion and then what was on sale is they had more of their fine fragrance mists for they're normally $14 they were like $3.98 or something like that and what started the train that led to all of this is the ever so famous cucumber melon just oh my goodness for spring it just smells so good it smells amazing and then they just had a bunch of like their classic ones they also had cherry blossom which is another fan favorite of mine sensual amber another really big fair fan of mine then another one that i just kind of was just like let me let me snort some of this and see what it smells like and this is pear berry and this smells really really good I mean my mom and I were just going around like touching things and smelling them it was absolutely amazing then two that were just 50% off and they kind of surprised me honestly the first one I saw was this pink cashmere and I was looking at the bottle and I was like oh, okay it doesn't it doesn't necessarily look like something that would draw me in and usually I like either like really fruity not fruity like food smelling ones like I need like a lot of vanilla and some whatever and I was just like oh and this one does have that like warm rich vanilla undertone that I was just like I was very surprised at how much I like this one and then we got the lemon pomegranate cream which was another one where I was like okay what is this one I mean you open them all and you smell them all and it also had that like fruity sweet but also that like vanilla hinty just oh to make it warm and a little bit more sensuous and I just oh I just I just had to have obviously all of it so that is the end that is all the wondrous beautiful oh wait I also got I wanted to show you guys but I can't, oh my goodness I'll be right back I got this from my mother-in-law she was just like what what frivolous thing would you like for your birthday and I was like I need a lipstick turnstile because with me a lot of my makeup is out of sight out of mind and if I'm able to have my lipstick out of a drawer where I can see them hopefully I will actually use them so that was very nice now that is the end I hope you guys enjoyed this rather somewhat pointless haul but hey hauling is hauling thank you guys so much for watching I love you and as always keep it real Mwah.